Kowalski, number 53. You see right, right there on your screen on Tony McGee, the tight end. First and goal from the four. Blake just throws it up. And it's smacked out of there by Mark McMillan. Well, Blake can't afford an interception at this point, Anthony, and, and he was dangerously close right there. Well, the design of that play, you have Carl Pickens, who's 6'2". He was a, a high jumper. But he's got high jumping background going against 5'7", Mark McMillan. And basically what Jeff Blake is doing on that play is just throwing it up and saying, here you go, Carl, you go up. You can out jump them. You have the size. Come down with it. 11 seconds left. Philadelphia leading by three. Blake. <laughs> To the end zone. Broken up by Michael Zordich. He was looking for the rookie Darnay Scott. Now you have third and goal from the four. And apparently the Bengals have made the decision. They're going for the tie. They are. They're going for the overtime as they send in Lee Johnson, the holder. Doug Pelfrey, the kicker. We have already had three overtime games this season. And as a group, it would be our fourth if Pelfrey drills this one. Well, interesting enough, our first game was up in Detroit, the Lions and the Falcons, and we had an overtime game. Here's the field goal, and it is good by Pelfrey. Tying the game at 30, and what a drive by Blake and the Cincinnati Bengals. Well, if we go back with over four minutes left, we said they needed two scores, and they had an offense with Blake at quarterback that had the, the potential of doing it. And here they have. They've scored twice, a touchdown and a field goal. And we sit with three seconds left, 30 to 30. What a game. <laughs> Super game. As we look at something that a lot of people take for granted, that a kick, you have to be coordinated. The center snapping the ball, the holder, Lee Johnson, putting it down. Just the right position for Doug Pelfrey as he kicks it through. And here we see the key play on this drive, the fourth down play where Blake gets some pressure. He needed 16. He needed 16. He pulls it down. He gets, gets a nice dive there at the end. Great running ability. We see Doug Pelfrey. His 27th field goal of the season. Tying horse Newman. And well, the Bengals 16 plays, 73 yards in 2 minutes, 8 seconds. And that 4th and 16 run by Blake you saw a moment ago kept the drive alive. And they're able to get a Doug Pelfrey field goal from 22 yards out, tying the game at 30. Tom, you know what that tells me? When you run 16 plays and you only use up 2 minutes, it tells me they did an excellent job of time management. Getting out of bounds every time they ran a play. They didn't keep it in the middle of the field. Usually a 16-play drive takes a lot longer than 2 minutes and 8 seconds. And they scramble for the football. One second remains on the clock, and Cincinnati is recovered. Pelfrey is going to get a try from long range to give the Bengals a victory. Brian O'Neill juggled the ball after the squib kick from Johnson, and the Bengals race in to recover. This is unbelievable. You see the ball bouncing around right there, and it cannot be handled. Lee Johnson just dribbles it. It works out. And as you mentioned, Doug Pelfrey gets a chance for a game-winning field goal with one second left. Pelfrey's career long is 53 yards. This one comes from 54. Does he have enough? Cincinnati has won the game. Can you believe that? in the final four and a half minutes to beat Philadelphia 33-30 on a career-long 54-yard field goal by Doug Pelfrey. Just, I can, just unbelievable. <laughs> unbelievable. They're sitting there 10 down with just a little over four minutes left, and they get a chance. You see the players right here carrying Tim Crumry, Crumry off the field as they come away with the victory for his last game in a Bengal uniform. 
And right here we take a look. The snap, Lee Johnson gets it down, and Pelfrey gets just enough as he puts it through, and you see the celebration. And our player of the game is Doug Pelfrey. The Miller Lite player of the game as he puts that one through with one second left. Well, for Anthony Munoz on Tom Brenneman saying so long from Riverfront Stadium, the Bengals over Philadelphia 33-30. Coming up next, an ASDAQ Stock Market post-game report. That follows this message from your local Fox station. You've been watching Fox Sports coverage of the National Football League. Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year. It's been a great season.